The city of San Jose can resume clearing a homeless encampment that's at Columbus Park. A federal judge lifted the temporary restraining order that was put in place a little earlier this month. But as our Crown Force Justin Campbell reports tonight, there's still not enough housing for all the encampment's residents. At Columbus Park, RVs and campers litter the street, but they will soon have to be gone. Everybody's nervous. Cheryl Imus lives at the park. Come here, kitty, kitty, kitty. We first met her earlier this month when she and six others filed a complaint to stop the city from clearing the encampment. Federal Judge Jacqueline Scott Corley issued a restraining order back on November 16th and blocked the city from clearing the encampment. But on Tuesday, the judge told the encampment residents they can't put up a trailer wherever they want. I was upset and I can't say I wasn't worried. I was worried and I'm worried now. Homeless advocate Scott Largen also lived at the encampment. He says he disagrees with the judge's reasons for lifting the restraining order. One of them, a claim that the city of San Jose is working on finding alternative housing solutions for people living at Columbus Park. The city is working on it. Well, that should show the judge right away. If the city is working on it, they've had plenty of time, plenty of money to put something together that they still haven't been able to do. I miss not sure where she'll go next, just preparing herself to move and winter weather coming. We don't have heat. We do have blankets. Reporting in San Jose, Justin Campbell, Cron 4 News.